Hey, FBJ, we just wanted to connect with you today to keep you up to date with things that are happening. As you've probably guessed, this Sunday will be live stream only again at 1030 a.m. And then again, our evening service will be put up at 6 o'clock p.m. Uh, but one thing that's new this week is we're going to provide Sunday school options for everybody. If you go to the church webpage and click on ministries, then to small groups, then to Sunday school, you will see a listing of all the classes that will be meeting online this week. If your class is not listed or if you're not already a part of a Sunday school class, we have a brand new class that's going to be starting this week, taught by Doug Gunn and Nick Walters, and we encourage you to join that class. Uh, there are instructions on how you can do that. A few other things that have been happening this past week. Boy, it's been exciting to see how many people have indicated to us that they're in on the three Psalms a day emphasis. In fact, the, the Instagram stories or Facebook stories that people have been posting about their reading has really been an encouragement to all of us. Now, Also this week, we've been feeding takeout plates to our Capitol Police. And on those takeout plates yesterday, there were thank you notes placed on every single one of them with just a note of encouragement and some Bible verses and a commitment that we as a church are praying for them. It's also come to our attention that there are many students on our local university campuses who are still in the dorms. And so we have people right now who are making care packages for them. And we're going to place notes with those care packages and just bless them and let them know that we're here for them and we're praying for them as well. Listen, at Mission First, there are great things going on. The, they're able to do online learning for the Early Learning Center. And they've been serving meals there in their local community as well. Here in the, the church facility, it's been a time for us to be able to do some updates to the building. We, we have brand new floors that have been installed in the elevators. Our guys have been doing a lot of touch-up paint work and, and really sprucing things up. We just can't wait for you to come back. Listen, I, we don't know how long this is going to last. But one thing we do know is that God is in control and every day that passes is a day closer for us gathering together again. We can't wait to see you back here. Thank you.